Hello beautiful people, welcome back to the Canada Info Hub channel, your one-stop channel for everything Canada and it's me your girl Wolo, I love 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 to talk about Canada because I love Canada, I am living in Canada, I am not experiencing any police brutality. <laughs> please don't mind me if you're new to this channel please subscribe to this channel click on the notification bell and destroy the like button but don't destroy your phone just give me a thumbs up for the sake of the youtube algorithm or whatever and if you must have noticed i have been doing some youtube testing on my channel so please bear with me for those who are looking for some videos i've been doing some youtube testing i just want to test something i don't know i want to test what youtube is doing anyway so back to today's video um last week was somehow for me with so much negativity in the media it was affecting my energy sort of i thrive on positive energy not negative energy so anything negative energy it just drains me but once it is positive energy i mean that's my fuel that's my adrenaline i, I am so pumped up with anything positive so last week was too much of negative news in the media with police brutality back in my home country sas and all that and it was just affecting me somehow and i just said no this is not happening this is not working let me just try and block that aspect of things for my from my space yes and then focus on the positive things in my life and the positive things that have been announced and that's why i decided to share this update there are two updates concerning um immigration well not really one of them is concerning immigration the other one is concerning the application process of one of the provinces so for um the first one it's the parents and grandparents sponsorship i've actually uh, posted it on the stories of this channel and um it's it's a good news for people who are in canada to sponsor their parents or their grandparents to become permanent residents in canada and for those who don't know it is exclusively um to those people who have stayed in canada for three years and have established themselves and have filed taxes because there's an aspect of the application process that has to do with your income so if you file your taxes for the past three years you, you should have a minimum net income to be able to sponsor your parents or your grandparents so for people who are on welfare they cannot sponsor their parents and grandparents because you have to sign a financial undertaking that your parents will not resort to social assistance during the period they will be living in canada and some other things until the years there's a certain number of years that was fixed i don't know how many years i can't remember so you have to sign that undertaking and part of it means you have to show that you have been working you've been filing your taxes and you meet the minimum net income and there's a way they calculate it i won't go into that details if you want more details you have to talk to a licensed immigration consultant for that yes so that's the update and it's good you see canada is one country that gives you the opportunity of inviting your family members inviting your parents to become permanent residents in canada so that's the first update and then the second update is concerning the alberta immigrant nomination program so the ainp um in april they announced that they have stopped processing applications for people outside canada so they've stopped doing selection draws for people outside canada and focusing on only people who are in canada and living in alberta those are the ones they process their application for nomination and they recently introduced a portal where people will be submitting their application after getting um the invites so it is similar to that of ontario if you go to the ontario website if you get a notification of interest from ontario what you actually do is go to the ontario portal and then submit your documentation so the same thing with alberta now they have introduced a portal where if you get a notification of interest in your express entry profile you have to submit your full application through the ainp portal and then from there you get your nomination previously you you have to email your documents to them but they've now introduced the portal and introduced a processing fee of $500. So for those who are expecting a provincial nomination from Alberta in the future, just know that you start paying $500 processing fee 
to process the nomination um, from Alberta. So those are the two updates for last week I said I was going to share and I hope you've learned something from this channel today. Um, so please, I'll encourage you just stay positive, drain anything negative out of your space, out of your environment, out of your space, remove every negative energy and only focus on positive energy that will be beneficial to you that will fuel you and you know make you to achieve things and thrive so that's what i wanted to share today thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to this channel click on the notification bell and anytime i upload a video you'll be the first to know don't forget to share with your friends and family thank you so much for watching and see you in my next video bye bye